Hey, I'm going to show you how to replace the lens on your Hero 8. So first things first, uh, the glass on the outside here, that's not the lens. That's not the actual lens. It's just protection glass that goes over top of the lens. The lens is the circular curved bit that's a little bit farther down inside the camera. And this glass on the outside is two millimeter thick Gorilla Glass, which is very, very strong, uh, but it can break and uh, more often it can scratch too. So GoPro doesn't make a nice pop-in replacement for this uh, lens like they did on the Session and the Hero 5, 6, 7, and 8. And a lot of people believe that the, the lens itself is not replaceable and the only options are to replace your camera, maybe if you have the Best Buy warranty, um, or to send it back to GoPro for a re replacement. But that's not true. It's actually really easy to replace and I'm going to show you how to do it. So what you need first is, well, your camera. You need one of these. It's a Camera Butter uh, Hero 8 replacement lens kit. You may need some tweezers and you need a heat gun. So I just use this, it's a paint stripper heat gun and it goes nice and hot. I don't think a hair dryer will work, uh, but you could try one. And a little piece of cardboard is helpful too. So here's how it's done. All right, so here's what you do. You take your camera and put it on some sort of surface that you don't really care about or that will not get damaged by the heat. This is just some carpet covered board that I have. Um, and then you take your piece of cardboard and I've cut a little kind of corner out of it here. And you put it like that on your camera and that's so the heat doesn't get to the rest of your camera because we've got a lot of heat involved here. You take your lens replacement kit, open it up and underneath there's a little pry tool and we're going to use that in a minute. So then we take our heat gun and we heat up the lens uh, to the point where it's almost too hot to touch. So you got to heat it up for quite a bit and while you're heating it up move it around a bit so it's not just pointing in one uh, little spot. Um, like I said you got to heat it up quite a bit but not so much that you can't touch it. So here we go. Okay, that might be enough. That's pretty hot. So we take our little pry tool, and kind of jam it in between the plastic and the glass. And you pry up. There we go. And it comes out. Now that glass is pretty hot. There we go. There's the glass. So we can see there's still a bunch of adhesive in there, so I like to take some tweezers and pull it out. And you kind of really, you do need to pull that stuff out because you need the new adhesive to stick well. Now, sometimes a little bit more heat will help. Get rid of that. There we go. Now it's coming out a lot more easily. Sometimes this all comes out just in one piece and it's really nice and easy. <laughs> and other times you have to dig a little bit. And try not to get anything down there on the on the lens while you're doing this. This is really the hardest part. It's getting all that adhesive out there. And like I said, if you're lucky, it all comes out in one nice piece, but this time I didn't get lucky. And 
And the more we can get this out and the cleaner we can make it, the better the new lens will stick in there. So even though it does take some time, it's worth doing properly. There we go. Okay, then the next step is we take, oh, sorry, just one little piece in there I want to get out. There we go. Then we take the replacement lens, okay? We can take the plastic off the front because we, uh, we can clean that later. There's this little tab, you pull the tab, so you pull the backing off the adhesive. You fit it in there. Give it a good press. And then these wipes, these are just meant to clean your lens afterwards. Here we go. It's like brand new. There you have it. I'll leave the link below to the uh, to the uh, replacement kit.